No, it, it really hasn't because what, a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, we were in the same same situation. And, uh, you know, winning that Northeast 10 championship against New Haven took a lot out of us, to be honest with you. And I didn't know how we would be able to recover and respond um, because everyone was on such an emotional high. To get through this tournament the way we did by coming back against Bridgeport um, and, and then finding a way uh, against Franklin Paris, and then tonight being down nine, uh, it's unbelievable. That they really are a team, and they're resilient. They stay together. They kept believing, and they kept believing in me because we kept doing different things. And their eyes were on me, and they believed in what we were telling them, and they believed in each other. And uh, talent's never been an issue. It's just that belief that right now is at, a, at an ultimate high for us. I think so, especially after the last game. And then you know, we got down um, by nine, and then all of a sudden we made our comeback, and I could just see the confidence in our guys and the ability to make plays. So 30 and two, you know, representing the East Region, heading down to Indiana. We got three games to go. I just know that we're gonna be a tough out, and uh, we'll be ready. Yeah, you hit on the head, and that's what we always tell these guys. Um, we preach we're five options, but they're all recruited for a reason. For their, their strengths all fitting together, and you finally see that out here on the floor. And that paid off for us tonight because every guy brings something different to the table. What's Luke Houston, Jose Cruz. Jose Cruz was tremendous off the bench for us, given the size and athleticism. Um, it just, I can't say enough good things about the guys. You feel more pressure with each, each win that goes by or not? Not anymore. Not anymore. We're going to really enjoy this trip, yeah. and we're going to take it all in, and we'll be prepared, we'll be ready, but it's not life or death, and we're going to enjoy it. And this is something that these guys, win or lose, they're going to take this experience with them for the rest of their life, and that's what it's about. That's what the game of basketball and sports, for that matter, is all about. So we're going to make the most out of this experience. Last thing for my two-year guys, and two-year Greg is right behind you, tears in his eyes, you saw time out with his family, hugging, emotional. This is, this is some kind of emotional moment for you guys. It really is because they've worked so hard, and you know we've we've had some real difficult losses, and for us to just climb out of where we where we were three four years ago to, to where we are now, you know I know I'm emotional, um, and it, I like seeing my guys emotional because that just proves how much they care um, about doing things the right way, both on and off the court. Because these guys are tremendous, both on and off the court.